All right, this is gonna be really short and simple. Gonna, gonna try to make this really short. So let's say that you wanted to uh, edit something in SketchUp instead. Let's say that we wanted to edit the body. So we will find which object the body is. And when you click on the body, uh, it, the name should appear here. Photon RE body bait. And to make sure that it is the body, you press edit mode and if the body actually lights up then you got it then you found the right one so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over here to the right and you're gonna click that eye icon and then you're gonna hover over the whole model hit a to select all delete yes and then we're gonna select that eye again we're gonna right click on the object to make sure it's selected you and here's the important part for the next step so you always got to make sure is this a material or uv texture so if i go in edit mode and a texture appears like this then you're going to click uv textures and you'll see what i mean when clicking on uv textures and stuff and then if you do go to edit mode and nothing shows up here then that means it's a material but since this is showing up right here, it's a UV texture. So you're going to make sure this is selected. You're going to go to File, Export, Collada Default. And uh, you're going to scroll down here. And since, it, since because it was a UV texture, we're going to click UV Textures. So I'm going to export that as a Collada. And yeah, that's how you export something to SketchUp with a UV texture. But let's say it wasn't a UV texture. Let's say that it was a material. So let's say for instance that it's, uh, let's go back. Okay, so let's say for instance that it's stop sign black holder. You can see as I'm going to edit mode and going back out, you don't see anything showing up here. It's just blank uh, and it, the picture's just not changing. I understood if I went to the right here and then I did edit mode that would be a UV texture because it changed but when you go to the stop sign holder and it doesn't change at all then yeah that's how you know that it's a material so when it comes to exporting materials uh, you're gonna find photon on RE stop sign black holder or whatever the material thing is click that I hit A to select everything, select delete, put the eye back on again, select it, go to file, export, collada, and then you're going to change this to materials. I'm going to name it the two because I don't want it to overlap this one. So we're going to export that and then let's go ahead and open SketchUp. Okay, now you can see that we're in SketchUp now. I'm using SketchUp 8. I'll send you guys the link if you need it. Well, I think most of you guys have SketchUp, but if you don't, just let me know and I'll send you the link. So you're going to go to File. I know you can't see it completely up here, but you're going to go to File, Import, and you're going to locate. So, and then, yeah, and then you're going to locate the files that you export. If you do not see it, make sure Google Earth Collada is selected for this file's a type, and the file name should be as corresponded. So you're going to get this little thing that says importing. Sometimes it will take a while depending on how big the file size is. Sometimes it will not. And there you go. So if you did this right, it should import just like this. And when you go to M model, the bake should be right there once you do it for UV textures. When it comes to materials itself, just wait for that to import. Sometimes you will get this message saying you are at the DAE or KMZ file you are attempting to import cannot be validated. That's fine. Just go ahead and ignore this thing and then click yes so it can import and there you go right there and you can see the material that popped up for it as well so yeah that's how you import stuff to SketchUp and I hope you guys are able to 
you know, edit whatever you need there just in case, like, you know. And, rem and uh, actually, I think I'll save that for another video. But, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I uh, hope this helped out, and uh, I'll see you guys later.